Welcome viewers. Today we will see WordPress website backup and restore through software class, which we get in the cPanel. Let's go to cPanel and then click WordPress Manager by Software Colors. You can see there is a shortcut at the right and you can get the icon at the bottom also in the software section. Let's click it. Let's check if they have any backup. We can see there has. Uh, let's go to the backup page. You can see there have no backup, so go back to WordPress Manager. From here, tick the installation. From the bottom, click Backup. Here, click Backup. Now in the backup page, tick the backup directory, backup database, select backup location as local folder. We can write a note as space backup. Finally, click backup installation. This backup will take a few seconds. And let's go to backup page. Here we can see a backup has generated. When we try to download, you can see here the complete size, which is 39 megabyte. Then show here show 20 megabyte. So let's go to cPanel file manager. Here in the local software colors backup folder, you can see select the file and click download. So here the file downloaded completely. So let's keep it in a different folder. And delete it completely from the cPanel to show you the restoration process. See after deleting the file, if we check the backup page, there is no longer backup showing in the backup page. Now we delete the whole WordPress site along with the database. To do that, go to the WordPress manager, take the installation from the bottom, click install. It will take us to installation page here. We will delete everything as you can see, then click remove installation. Okay, so after deleting, let's check the site, refresh it. See the site doesn't exist anymore and there is no backup as well as it deleted it. So let's upload the backup file and restore the website. Go to let's go to the local software colors backup folder in cPanel and upload the backup file we downloaded before. Here click upload and select the file. It will take a few minutes to upload. Ok, 
Okay. Don't take so much. Okay, so it's completed. After uploading the file list, refresh the backup page in the cPanel software class WordPress Manager. Let's go to uh, here. You can see the backup files appearing here. So just we, you can just click the restore from the restoration page, check all, and from the bottom click restore installation. Okay, so it's it's just uploading the file database and it's done. See, it's very easy. Let's check. Refresh the page. You can see the site is live, and it is wise to take a backup of a fresh website. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.